Hello, and welcome to Good Deeds. It's brought to you by JustServe.org. If you are looking for ways to help make this a better community by helping people, well, you can connect with organizations through JustServe.org. It's a wonderful place to start. Today, we are finding out more about how a local organization is helping to build confidence and self-reliance in kids through biking. Please welcome Garrett. We're gonna talk about the family free ride. Welcome to the show. And what, thank you so much for the work you're doing for kids in our community. Oh, you're welcome, Cheryl. Thanks for having me on. I appreciate it. How did Family Free Ride start? Um, I had kids and uh, tried to get them out to ride bikes and quickly realized they'd have a lot more fun riding if their friends came along. So I started bringing along all their friends and uh, kind of developed from there. What did you uh, learn about kids and the benefit of biking, benefits of biking when you were out on these rides? I think I think every parent is has the same feeling that you want to get your kids off the screens more and get them outdoors and be active. So um, that was the goal is uh, have them do something that was fun. Uh, you know, I grew up as a kid riding bikes um, just as a way of transportation. And then and then later in life, I really got into mountain biking for recreation. So I uh, kind of want my kids to to do that so we can go out and do some adventures together. Yeah. Now, as the program has grown, what are some of the things that you're doing in the Sacramento area to help promote biking amongst kids? So there was like this uh, epiphany moment that I had and um, we were on a bike ride and it was about five years ago, kind of, this was what started the whole idea of, of developing this bike park. Um, we were on the American river trail and, and my son who was about five years old at the time, almost got ran over by, by another cyclist. It was just, you know, a series of unfortunate events that led to it. But, um, the cyclist went down and then I realized then that we really needed a place for the kids to be able to ride safely and have fun. And so that's when we started to really get into um, developing the Fair Oaks bike park and make that a fun place for the kids to ride. Yeah. And, and your organization has made a lot of improvements to the Fair Oaks bike park. Yeah. Um, the, the park district got it started in what, 2018 and then we stepped in in 2019 and kind of um, started doing something almost every year to expand it, make it better, um, add features that really help kids improve their riding ability and, and just have a lot of fun. The more you ride, the better you'll get. Absolutely. In a nice, safe environment. And you've got to love that as a parent. Um, I noticed on your website that you have events, um, that you've done some really cool bike fests in the past. Do you have any events that are coming up soon? Yeah. So we have uh, the Kids Bike Fest. Is This will be our fourth year of doing it. And it's coming up in May, I think, um, May 5th, Cinco de Mayo. Oh, wow. So um, that'll be a good event. And then we usually do a uh, Christmas bike light ride in December. And we might have some more events coming up. I think what we really are trying to get to do is, um, you know, we want to start hosting almost like competitions, like, uh, like races for kids. Because, you know, you develop it as a team sport and the kids and the parents can really get into it. So that's what we're working on. We've been working on that for a while and, um, you know, we just have to make it happen. Yeah. Well, how can we as the community support the work that you're doing with Family Free Ride? Um, yeah. So the, the biggest thing is if people want to come out to the, the Kids Bike Fest on May 5th. Um, yeah, that, that's the biggest thing that we can do and uh, buy a T-shirt, buy some stickers. We've got uh, we'll have a barbecue and we'll do a race for the kids um, and then just keep tuned. Stay tuned for when we get our uh, bike program going for uh, kids in elementary school. Yeah, we'll get the website up on the screen here so folks can see how to contact you. And I think it's fantastic what you're doing. You know, back when I was a kid, um, we wanted to be out on our bikes because bikes were freedom. But it's amazing how things have shifted in just a, a couple of generations. Yeah, it's, you know, it can be dangerous out there. Um, you know, even adults, I have a lot of friends that have been hit by cars and that's kind of why I, I like to stay on, on the mountain bike dirt trails off the roads. But, um, yeah, we definitely, the, the more the kids can ride and become better, they'll become safer if they do have to ride on streets. Absolutely. Well, you're doing a great thing for the kids in our community. Thank you for that. And thank you for being on Good Deeds. You're welcome, Cheryl. Thank you for having me.